As the name suggests, a lung infection is a type of respiratory infection that affects the lungs. They are typically caused by viruses, bacteria, or fungi and can lead to several unwanted signs and symptoms. In this video, we're going to provide a brief overview of the most common types of lung infections and talk about their symptoms and how they can be treated. So if you're ready, let's get into it. In general, respiratory therapists are required to care for patients with several different types of lung infections. Some examples include influenza, tuberculosis, bronchitis, and pneumonia. Each type of lung infection has its own prognosis. Additionally, the treatment methods for each type may vary depending on the severity of the patient's signs and symptoms. First, let's talk about influenza, or the flu. Influenza is a highly contagious viral infection that primarily affects the respiratory system. It is typically spread through coughing or sneezing and can also be contracted by touching an infected surface and then touching your mouth or nose. Next up is tuberculosis, which is a bacteria that primarily affects the lungs. It is spread through the air and can be contracted by inhaling infected droplets from a cough or sneeze of someone with the infection. And then there is bronchitis. Bronchitis is an infection of the bronchi, which are the air passages that lead to the lungs. It is typically caused by a virus and is spread in the same way as the flu. And finally, we have pneumonia, which is an infection of the lungs that can be caused by bacteria, viruses, or fungi. It is typically spread through coughing or sneezing and can also be contracted by aspirating contaminated foods or liquids. We have several videos on our channel that go into more details about pneumonia, so definitely check those out if you want to learn more. But whenever a lung infection is present, it can lead to a variety of different signs and symptoms. While there are many differences, most types of lung infections do share some common signs and symptoms, including the following. Coughing up mucus, shortness of breath, wheezing, chest pain or tightness, fever, chills, fatigue, body aches, and a loss of appetite. In severe cases, a patient may also experience hallucinations, confusion, and an inability to stay awake. Now let's talk about the treatment methods. Treatment for a lung infection will vary depending on the type of infection and its severity. For example, influenza is typically treated with antiviral medications, while tuberculosis is treated with antibiotics. In most cases, however, the treatment method should focus on relieving symptoms and supporting respiratory function. This may include bronchodilators, mucolytics, and potentially even intubation and mechanical ventilation in severe cases. But again, for this video, we just wanted to provide you with a brief overview of the most common types of lung infections. We have separate videos on our channel that go into more detail of each type if you want to learn more. But real quick, if you don't mind, hit the like button to support the channel. I really do appreciate it. And be sure to subscribe for more videos like this. And just a final reminder, we are not doctors. This video is for informational purposes only. Thank you so much for watching. Have a blessed day. And as always, breathe easy, my friend.